I'm here with John Godlasky from Towson University. And John, uh, welcome to CA Football Media Day. Thanks. Returning starter at uh, tight end, and, and uh, talk about some of the goals for, for you and, and for the Towson offense, some of the things you'd like to accomplish this season. Um, I think it, it starts up front with the O line. We got uh, our entire offensive line coming back, and that's it's going to be huge for us. And uh, our receiving core is uh, excellent this year. David Newsom at wide receiver and uh, Hakeem Moore, they're going to step up and make some plays. And, uh, I hope to get some more uh, catches this year. And, you know. I was going to ask you, you know, as a tight end, you get to be part of, uh, of both of those. Uh, you know, I saw you, you were the lineman of the year for Towson last year, which is a great honor for a tight end, but it's got to be also be fun to, to be out there running in the open field. What, what part of the, uh, of the game do you like the best? Um, well, I've been uh, pretty much known as a blocker since I've gotten here, and, uh, you know, I, I love blocking, but I'd like to get some more, uh, more stats up there and get, get some more catches. You kind of so. changed your reputation a little yeah. bit, huh? Yeah, a little bit. Yeah, that's so. good. Now, uh, you're from a football family. You're telling me your grandfather played football at Penn State. Is uh, you a big Nittany Lion fan growing up? And does he ever tell you stories about what college football was like in the yeah, old days? Yeah, my whole family is are big Penn State fans. And uh, he uh, he told me about how uh, his first year uh, was uh, Joe Paterno's first year there. So, uh, yeah, you know, he, I've seen some uh, family pictures with Joe Paterno in it. And uh, yeah, it's, it's pretty exciting. It's hard to imagine that uh, he's able to keep up the energy and still be able to coach this year. Can you imagine uh, yeah, still yeah, being in your 80s and still be doing it? He's that old and still kicking and still being a head coach at that level. Now, uh, we talked about uh, this has been the first season for Towson under Coach Ambrose and uh, we've had a chance to go through spring ball and summer workouts. What, what's been the difference and uh, are you excited about the first year with him? I'm definitely excited. I think uh, the biggest difference is he's bringing in a winning attitude and uh, you know, just uh, he he's all about winning and he, he wants us to play at our best and I think that's you know the biggest thing is you know is changing uh, the complete attitude from thousands is you know we're obviously you know pick last to you know over here and you know we're, we're ready to change that we're ready to prove some people wrong this year. Certainly the uh, CA has got a reputation as the nation's top uh, FCS conference and a lot of ranked teams just in your own south division yeah. talk about the challenges of, uh, of the weekend weekend week out challenges the CA. Definitely uh, it's definitely the toughest conference in the nation for uh, for our division, and uh, I I love it to be honest. You know, I love going out there and playing. You know, top opponents every week, and uh, you know that's it's what it's all about. You know, and every year a team from the CAA is competing for the national championship, and uh, that's what's that's what's great from our perspective is that no one no one sees us coming, and uh, it's opportunity to upset some of the best teams in the nation every week. Yeah. Now you're a native of uh, Hershey, Pennsylvania, of course, yeah. uh, the chocolate capital of. Uh, uh, the United States. What's uh, did you ever uh, bring any uh, Hershey snacks back for any of uh, your yeah, teammates? Or yeah, are you no, a big they, chocolate guy? I'm not. I'm not a, a, a big chocolate guy. But, you know, uh, every now and then I'll I'll catch a, some ragging from the teammates saying like, oh, you're from Hershey, uh, bring us back some chocolate. And, yeah. So I, I'm not. I'm not a big chocolate guy. You know, just because I'm from Hershey. So. All right, John. Thanks for your time today, uh, and hope you enjoy media day. Thanks a lot. Thanks.